Hey there YouTube and your boy back with another video. In today's video, I'm going to show you how you can set up your Geo MiFi 2 with your PC and also gonna give your laptop or PC without having a Wi-Fi connection. Hey guys, you should be for my boy YouTube for what I do. Let's get started. So as you guys can see here, this is my Windows PC or not, actually this is my Windows laptop. So in this video, I'm just going to show you how you can connect this GeoFi 2, which is a portable 4G hotspot with your laptop or PC. Yeah, my friend just told me that I'm not, uh, can you please tell, make a video how you can connect this GeoFi 2 with a PC, not with a laptop. So in this video, you can uh, easily get this uh, by seeing this video. So first of all, I will show you how you can connect it and configure with this uh, laptop. If you guys have a laptop, you can easily do it. There is no problem. So as you guys can see, here, there's a Wi-Fi tab, and there's GeoFi 2 which is connected. And after connecting this, you, what you want to do here is just go in your Chrome or whichever browser you have. So I will just use Chrome here. So here it is, Chrome basically. All right. And now uh, what you want to write here is you can either write the uh, IP address. So what is the IP address? I'll just talk in a later part of the video. So in this case, you just want to write, uh, if you have a laptop or PC, you want to write GEO5, uh, GIO, GEO5. As you guys can see, this is the, uh, uh, what do you say, this is the address. I'll just zoom in and show you guys. Okay guys, so this is the address, geofi.local.html. Uh, this is the web address which you want to enter here to configure a GEOFI device. And now just click enter here. So I'll also link down, link down this whole address in the description box of the video so you guys can easily check it out if you guys want to. So after entering this address, I'll just lower the brightness. No, that's fine. After entering this uh, geofi.local.html, geofi .local you will find this kind of page if you have a geofi device. And now quickly just log in to configure a device. So the password, first of all, it will be administrator, administrator. I will change the password to administrator and the secondary password is something else. So the username will be administrator and the password will also be administrator if you bought a new new GeoFi device. Now just click login. Okay guys, yeah. And after clicking the login, as you guys can see, there is a turn and turn of option here. The first option is that it shows that LTE status which is connected. And then it will show you some time which is 2 hours, uh, two hours, 19 minutes, 58 seconds or something like that. You can find tons and tons of options and now you will ask me what if I just want to configure my uh, what if I just want to configure my password so you, I just zoom in so you guys can see it, see it easily and now you just want to go here in uh, settings there you find this tons and tons of options basically as you guys can see there are some options I just don't know if you guys can see or not but uh, there are some options network, Wi-Fi, storage, user management, firmware updates, WPS and advanced so if you guys want to change your password, which is by default a uh, very complicated password, so you just want to need to go here in Wi-Fi. As you guys can see here, there's the name of Wi-Fi, SSID, and then this is the security key. I'll just zoom in. Alright guys, so this is the security key. Okay. I don't know if you guys can see it clearly or not, but this is the security key. And now if you want to change here, so just enter your whatever password you want, and after that just click here apply. And then after that your password will be saved. And yeah, sorry for the background noise, it will be uh, difficult to hear you, you guys. But yeah, this is how you can configure all the device. Just I'll just close this tab. Yeah, and you can also configure with the mobile device. I'll just show you how you can do the same. Now what you want to do is just take, take a USB micro USB cable. Okay. And then just connect this. Okay, I just don't know where it is. And yeah, please keep this plastic cover handy because it's really scratchable. Okay guys, so I'll just keep it on the side and now just simply connect this USB cable to your PC or laptop, uh, actually to the PC. Okay guys, so this is now connected and yeah. Yeah, this is basically now connected. As you guys can see here, it was first Wi-Fi but now it's just showing me, I'll just show you guys. Okay, yeah. It is showing me GeoFi, uh, GeoFi 2 modem connected not wi-fi wi-fi is also connected but it is just modem showing me that it's modem connected let's zoom, zoom in and show you guys okay all right guys so as you guys can see here the sign has been changed and sorry for the bad quality because i just zoomed in with my Redmi Note 3 okay guys so now let's quickly turn this off like this okay as you guys can see now i'll just uh, give you a tip if you guys want to download tons and tons of movies with unlimited data, please use this USB connection because it will definitely increase your speed. 
yeah it will definitely definitely increase your speed please use this okay so now let's quickly surf our youtube channel this is my channel name all right guys as you can see that it's working perfectly and yeah this is the giveaway this is the giveaway video and please do comment in this video or in this giveaway video i will also link down this giveaway video if you guys want to see it this is the announcement video basically so you guys can comment it down in the video if you guys want a giveaway or not so this was working perfect and yeah so as you guys can see this will also work with pc my, my friend just asked me that what if i just have a pc and not a wi-fi or enable laptop so I just told him that this method will 100% work and this will also increase the speed. Guys, so I'll just show you how you can configure it with your mobile device. So this is my iPod Touch. Uh, I don't know if you guys see it for the first time or not. Okay, so I'll just pause the video and focus it on my iPod Touch. I'll just come back in a just a second. So as you guys can see, this is my iPod Touch. I know that you are just seeing it for the first time. So now what you want to do here is the address which I told you which was zeofi local.html will not work in a mobile device. So what you want to do here is just enter the IP address of your router. Just go in Chrome. I'll just zoom in a bit so you guys can check it easily out. Alright. So as you guys can see here this web server is not working perfectly. Okay. So now this is a secret trick. I just don't know if you guys know already. Now just enter your IP address of your Geo device, which is one nine, which is basically one nine two one nine two dot one six eight dot one dot one. As you can see here, it directly shows me to web admin. And now just click go. So this web page has been quickly loaded. I know it is very easy. All right, I'll just zoom out. Yeah, so this web address has been quickly loaded and after this you can configure all the things that you are able to do with your PC or laptop. So this was a really really easy process and this please enter this 192.168.1.1 or any other IP address if your device has the same. And if you guys want to check where is my IP address you can just go here and check. Okay, just a second guys. Okay, just go in device details basically. I just forgot where is the IP address. Uh, just please bear with me, guys. I'll just show you where you can find your device IP address. LAN info. Yeah. So this is in the LAN info. This is the LAN info status, and you can find here the IP address, which is 192.168.1.1. Gateway IP. I think there is some different IP for some different devices. You guys can check it out. So if you like this video, please give a thumbs up, and if you're not. You know what to do. So this is Bhushan signing off and I hope to see you in my next video. You guys have a great day.